Hi everyone. <laughs> so um, this video, um, we just wanted to sort of go back to why we actually started the channel. Um, and fingers crossed you're enjoying what we're actually producing at the moment. So obviously the, the point of our channel was our health conditions. Uh, mine with me uh, chronic myeloid leukemia and primary progressive multiple sclerosis cervical stenosis high blood pressure the the list is just endless and then we've got Alison with her health conditions which are fibromyalgia uh, FND which is functional neurological disorder google that and diabetes and high blood pressure and everything else that goes with it yeah so between us we've got quite a quite an array of health conditions but what we wanted to get across was that it, we try not to let this get us down on a daily basis um, we're really positive about it we do share our experiences we talk to people about um, any health conditions that we actually have um, we feel that if people know it's easier for them, it's easier for us. Um, so we don't actually hide any of this, but obviously part of our channel was to try and inspire other people to get up and get out um, and not just think of an illness that is potentially going to be like a life-threatening thing or anything like that. Somebody um, really wants me on the phone. Yeah, Alison's <laughs> phone keeps pinging. So it was a case of just trying to let people see how we do things and hopefully inspire other people to do exactly the same. Um, so we're hoping so far that you've enjoyed our, our days out and our trips away and our little trusty uh, camper van, big red, a little silver camper van. Um, I did see a boat like that the other day. I yeah. sent you a picture, I was walking, well, trying to walk by a harbour and um, I, look, I was looking at the boats because I like to paint and um, there was this lovely white boat and it had a sign saying big red on it and I took a photo for Andrew to see it. You're not the only one who's a bit mad. Yeah, little does Alison know that's my boat and <laughs> she knows no about it. <laughs> I so did that was think a bit, that. It was a bit good that she found me boat uh, moved up in the harbour. <laughs> <In> the harbour. <laughs> <laughs> but Can I just um, say though, even though we are at a stage where we are enjoying our trips and everything, we're not going to sugarcoat everything. In the beginning, it was hard. I'm going to say a couple of years ago when Andrew was on a different medication, I did think I was losing him. There was a time when he was extremely ill. And I think coming through that, has, and you've sort of leveled off on this different medication, and now's the time for us to do the traveling and everything while he's at that level stage. and. Things may I mean, look easy on the videos. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, when we're actually recording the videos and stuff like that, obviously we record, you know, good bits and bad bits and stuff like that. But yeah. you know, there's, there's times when we're walking, um, we both use a walking stick, and there's many times in the video I keep having to hand Alison me walking stick or drop me walking stick down while I record something. Um, and you know, there might be something where we've walked along a beach that's you know 100 yards or something but the video doesn't show that we've stopped off maybe three or four five six seven times along that time period just to get some of these yeah. shots um and it is it it does play on you and it is quite a hard toll um yeah. you'll have seen if you've watched any of our um scotland videos and stuff we're regularly in bed by about half past seven <laughs> obviously missing the northern lights and everything else that goes on during <laughs> yeah, that time. Did. But it is one of them things where um, it, it, it does play a toll on you and it is hard work, but we really still enjoy it. Yeah, um, wouldn't don't, change it. Don't get me wrong, when we get into bed on a night, we just lie back and both of us go, oh, because we're now resting. And, you know, that's really nice. And we're I wouldn't change it. Not a thing, not a no. thing. I mean, the best thing we've done was actually buy the camper van yeah. um, and get that fixed up the way we wanted it. It worked for us um, and it is working really well. And obviously we've got the, the four dogs, which I'm surprised <laughs> none of them's actually interrupted us yet because we've got one of them lying down on the deck and another two on the chair and the blind dogs just jumped just down off the wonder. chair yeah. and she's ready to have a go at the dog next door, I think. <laughs> yeah, this is our garden part of it. Um, 
I just want to say we've, I know we have inspired some friends to maybe get a caravan or a camper van. Um, they have said it's hard for them to watch um, how we have changed in the past few years just walking and that but they love the videos and it's sort of inspired them to get out and do the same um, which the, is lovely it's the, really the nice the thing is yeah we we've both had our challenges yeah and it's a case of that we're not going to let them challenges stop us doing what we want to do um, we love being out and about, we love being with the dogs, we love taking them out and while we still can, we will. Um, it is getting a little bit more difficult but we, we thoroughly enjoy it. Um, we just take our time. As I say on the video, um, we, we do chop and edit a lot of just like the rubbish bits out. Hopefully we leave the good stuff, hopefully. Um, we were thinking about keeping the outtakes in but I don't think you've got enough memory for that. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> like the bit where Andrew was trying to put his wetsuit on and things like that. You didn't have like three hours of spare footage oh, yeah. time, did you? Yeah. So um, we added yeah. little things out like that. Yeah. But I mean, obviously, we love doing these videos. We want to keep on doing these videos. Um, it's fantastic that uh, people are subscribing. We would love to get more subscribers. Um, I mean, our passion would be that if we could actually get monetized on YouTube. We've still got a long way to go, but if anyone can help us that way by sharing our videos, getting more subscriptions, everything that would be fantastic. We have set up our um, Buy Me A Coffee page, if anyone wanted to donate anything on there. But instead of just buying us a coffee, um, what I've decided to actually do as well is we've put a shop on there. And the shop is, if you're buying us a coffee, that will be a donation of £5, which will be really appreciated. But what we've actually done is, um, I used to be a photographer in a previous life and still enjoy taking photography, um, taking all these lovely images and what I'm starting to do is I'm uploading some of these images. So for £7.50 you can actually download a digital file of these images, range from maybe 4 megabytes up to 20 megabytes. Uh, so you know you can print these yourself frame them, get them done as a big poster, whichever, you know, wherever suits. Um, we're still thinking of a way we can incorporate Alison's artwork. Um, we don't know whether we offer original artworks or whether we just offer um, like a print from that artwork. Um, again, either a digital download or a physical print. Mm. So we're still working on that. Uh, let us know in the comments if, uh, if you've got any ideas or suggestions, if uh, about artworks and stuff and as I say you know instead of just buying us a coffee we want to give something back in the form of uh, a digital download if you wanted to go down that route again subscriptions is really important for us so we really appreciate every subscription we really appreciate every comment that we get as well it's nice to hear people's it feedback is, isn't it? and to actually we reply to all of our comments um, and it is really really good so we thoroughly enjoy that um, are we going to that, um, this is FND, the van thing, the van Losing fest. Losing our marbles. Yeah, that happened years ago. Yes, we are. Um, obviously, we have a few trips planned in the future. Um, one of them is uh, the van festival that Alison started about, which is um, um, Camper Jam Come here. in Shropshire. Come here. Where are you? Um, Obviously, she's just Come she's here. just spun this one on us, so I kind of think of a date. But uh, I know that's You'll coming soon. On. But we, we, we will be recording that. And if anybody's going there, it would be great to actually meet you as while you're yeah. there. Um, so that people would want to look out for. Um, we are planning on uh, heading back up to Scotland again for another road trip. Oh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Um, obviously, this time round, we're going to be taking in the Highlands again and heading up to the Isle of Skye. Um, it just looks stunning it and while does. we're up there i'm gonna get that paddle board out again <laughs> and i will be paddle boarding <laughs> i have got a bit of a plan i've got a little inflatable cushion that i might be able to <laughs> nail and sit on this cushion so i think yeah. i might have gave up trying to stand up on it yeah. because i physically kind of get my legs up in the right position but yeah. nailing on it i'm working on that plan um so yeah all the good stuff again like subscribe share it with everyone um 
check out old buy me a coffee page we are putting a few posts in there as well so even if you don't want to donate just check it out and see what it's all about and we really appreciate all your support so fantastic and thank you very much <coughs>